because when I was going for all my acting roles and not getting anywhere, mm. my friend rings me. She's like, Baze, what do you want? I said, nothing, I'm chilling. She was like, listen, get your passport. We've got to go, we weren't flying away, but you needed your passport. We're going to the Excel Center in London. Mm -hmm. I was like, why? She was like, to audition for Big Brother. I was like, babe, you're mad. I was like, I'm an actress. Like, I don't want to do no reality <laughs> TV. Yeah. Although I've got to say, yeah. Big Brother, my Come favorite on. show. Yeah, yeah. Loved it, loved it from the beginning, like loved it. Um, so anyway, I go with her, but more of like something to do for the day, yeah? Mm. Anyway, I'm start, I'm queuing at the Excel Center, and when I say there's people, well, we're talking like 70,000 people, mm. so many people, and I said to my friend, I said, listen, I said, Tiff, do not say we're friends when mm -hmm. we go for this first audition, because they're gonna battle us. She's a complete opposite to me, blonde, white, very pretty, but mm -hmm. complete, I just knew what was gonna happen, mm -hmm. yeah. She was going for it as well? She's the one that asked me to go, innit? Wait, was she trying to get in there as well? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. So anyway, we're queuing, as we're queuing, they've got this camera going up and down, and these, I didn't know at the time, but they were producers, and they kept looking at me, right? So I was like, all right, cool, whatever. Anyway, we- So they were looking at you? Or them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, innit? <laughs> And um, I didn't go there revealing or anything like that. Anyway, it was cold, it was freezing. Anyway, so we've queued up for hours now. When we get there, they put us in, I think it was like groups of like 10 or 15. Mm -hmm. And they basically say, I'm gonna be raw in a minute, you know? Mm -hmm. Raw, I'm gonna tell you something raw. Mm -hmm. They make you um, talk to each other and, and say things. Anyway, she, Tiffany, she said, oh yeah, we're friends. I thought, why would you do that when I've just told you not, not to? Yet. So they put us up against each other. And I, thought, and I know I'm going to win. Mm. Do you know what I mean? I, I, I know I'm going to win. So you tried to tell her? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tried to give her... I tried to give her the heads up. She <laughs> yeah. didn't listen and I got in the show. Uh, <laughs> so... yeah. What did they have you do? So they, this is the peak pit. I mean, it's bad. So they said, tell me something really controversial about yourself. So I don't, be, I don't play. Do you know what mm. I mean? I don't care what I say. Mm. I probably so my should. Questions. I probably should, but I need yeah. a filter. I need a muzzle, mm. honestly, spray. Like it's yeah. bad, you know, yeah. in my mouth. So they said, oh, this is bad, what I'm going to say, oh. you know. <laughs> they, bad, bad. They Damn said, um, what is it that's controversial? I said, well, have you ever looked at a dog's tongue and thought, oh, that look at your face. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was saying. Listen, no one would say it. I wouldn't do it, by the way. I was saying that a dog's tongue. Allegedly. That, no, I wouldn't. Come on, man. I'd never do that. So I said that, and then I got through, right? This is the first audition of thousands and thousands of auditions. So I get through. Anyway, so my girl's out. You had a dog lick out your pom pom. No. No, I didn't say that. I said, have you, have you ever looked at a dog's but tongue? But what did you want the tongue to do? That's what I'm saying. What do you... No, 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 no. But you know what? To look at your pom pom, innit? I'm saying that the, the tongue to... looks, it's big. Yeah, but what do you, would you expect the tongue to do? What yeah, but not you... a dog's tongue. You know what I'm saying? I'm not into bestiality here. Yeah, Come on, let's keep no, it 100. Mind like, mind definitely mind not. It's actually a thing. It's, that, it's, it's a thing. No, it's definitely a thing, but it's not my thing. We need to make this crystal clear. I'm saying I had to be controversial and I looked at a dog's tongue before and they're long and fat and I thought, hmm. Anyway, it got me through to the first bit, so we're good. But I've got to clarify, no bestiality here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm serious. No, <laughs> There's no, no. none. Uh, it, listen, <laughs> each to their own. <laughs> I'm just, it's not my, it's not my thing. It's not my thing. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Each to their own, like, do you know what I mean? But no. So then, how, how did that make you feel when you got through? So I got through to that first bit, and mm. then I got sent upstairs. And that day I had... Um, a, another audition, it was to camera, camera on camera, uh, me and the camera. Mm. And it said, you've got one minute to sell yourself. Mm. And I was speaking to the camera and basically, I think I remember saying, look, you look at me, you might think porn star, lap dancer, whatever, but I'm not. I said, I'm a tomboy. But basically my character yeah. was the opposite, like I said mm -hmm. earlier. Mm -hmm. And um, I don't know why, that I'm not like a, so, uh, what's the word? Like, um, I'm not a witch, do you know what I mean? But I knew, I just knew in my gut, that you that was good. I just knew it was good, yeah? So I moved on from that stage on the same day, there was three stages and I had to write something and as I'm writing this thing, it's like a psychological test, I'm assuming. Mm. As I'm looking in the corner, I see the people that were walking past me earlier, staring at me. And I just, you know, when you just got that vibe in it, that feeling, I just knew that they, um, that they were like, going like, look, who's that girl? Yeah, like, blah, yeah. blah, blah. <clears throat> so from then, it literally, this is no lie, this is so long. I had three months of auditions to get onto Big Brother. Really? It's mad, isn't it? It's That's three mm. months. Do you mad. know that they give you a, um, a safe word? Mm. So when they ring you, mine was Starbucks, funny enough, but when they ring you, you, you have to say, what's the word? Like, it's, it, back then, <laughs> yeah. if you got, like, people found out who you were, you weren't going you on weren't the show. Going show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, this is, oh, we're talking old school Big Brother. Yeah. Like, this yeah. is a thing. Yes, Davina, yeah, 100%. Yeah, um, mm. Anyway, so these three months of auditions, and I mean, I, I couldn't even tell you how many I, got, I had. Each time I thought, you know what, Sass, like, 
this is looking all right, you know. Mm. But again, everyone's got to go through it and people are going to get disappointed because they only pick 12 people. And then it got to a point where producers said, this is right, going through lots of the auditions. They said, like, can we come out with you? Sure. We just want to come out with you for I one did, night. I and they, yeah, and they get you drunk. Yeah, and I'm nuts, you know. It, it, I'm nuts. Mm. I'm nuts. I was nuts then. I'm more nuts now. And um, we went out. I got drunk. I would fell over. I'd cut my leg. No. Like, it was nuts. <laughs> like, honestly, it was nuts. And I'm lemon as well. I'm mouthy, innit? So I was mm. thinking, oh, my gosh. Like, how are they going to let me in once they hear I'm so trappy? So um, anyway, then I get this call. And this, I get the call and it said, um, Saskia, this is whoever, Starbucks. And um, you, you just want to let you know that congratulations, you are one of our fine, our housemates this mm. year. Mm. And that feeling right there mm -hmm. was from the girl that said, I'm an actress. Yeah. I don't want no <laughs> business. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll be honest, because I'm not going to lie to anyone. I will always be 100% truthful. I didn't go on Big Brother to experience it. I went on there to get famous. Mm. Like, I'm never going to lie. Mm. So at that moment, I got that call. I was like, yes. People are going to know yes. so I can now yes. move on yeah. to get mm. some acting roles. 100%. I just mm. thought, this is me. Like, I'm now, and I remember walking down the street, um, High Street, and it sounds really muggy now, but I'll be, I'm going to be honest. And I was walking down thinking, you lot are all going to know me in a minute. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking, you're going to know me. Yeah. And, and you've got to remember, Cream, back in the day, yeah. there was only four channels, you know. Come on. There was none of this other yeah. stuff, YouTube, yeah. whatever. So how did your friend feel when you said that? So listen Do you remember to telling this. <laughs> no, Cream, you're not ready for this, right? <laughs> so they had drummed it into me, big brother. If oh, yeah. it's leaked, you can't. You can't. Mm. And I love my girl more than life itself, but <laughs> she's got a mouth on yeah, her. Yeah, you could never. Yeah, I could. She's she the last bad person I could tell. Bad mind you. Yeah, she yeah, yeah. Bad yeah. Yeah. Hundred percent. No, they want to. Yeah, hundred percent. So I just thought, you know what? Definitely not. Didn't tell her. But what I did do was on. I oh know, so let me, I'll come on to that bit. Yeah. So basically, so I get into Big Brother, I'm excited. Then they ring me and say, right, you're going into hiding for two weeks to France. Mm -hmm. So they, I don't think they do that now, but that's how hush hush. It was proper back then, isn't it? Proper yeah. with your four channels that you know everyone's watching, right? Mm -hmm. So I was getting a bit worried, like leaving my mum. I was thinking, I don't know why, because obviously I'm quite close You're to my mum. You're the oldest as well, weren't you? I'm the oldest. And where we got flare streams, go on. We got fly streams. Um, where I'm, I've had a lot of illnesses when I was younger. My mum made me quite scared of things when I was younger. So I was thinking, oh my God, what if, because you're not allowed your phone even when you're in hiding. So they said, you're not, I'm going to make mm. you laugh a minute. You're not allowed to ring no one, nothing. Mm. So I meet my chaperone. Did I you go, have a boyfriend at the time? Yeah. How old is that? Was he Ooh. jealous? So... God. Yeah, carry on. <laughs> you so, wait. No, you yeah, wait. Finish off saying what she said. Um, <laughs> so I had a boyfriend. Oh, my. So I go, I go to France. I'm in some, uh, you like in country, do you know what I mean? Anyway, the chaperone, she's sweet, but she's a total opposite to me, right? Mm. Complete opposite. So anyway, one night I was like, come, let's go out. So I go Try out. Quiet at the <laughs> <window>. <laughs> <laughs> Like suck, suck in the crisp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See your crisp cream. It's, it's all right. I told you this makes me cough. Um, mm. So we're in um, we're in France now. Yeah. Days I'm getting bored. I take her out. I get yeah. a mash up. I get her so drunk. So I nick her phone. Mm. Sorry, big brother. It happened. I, I nicked her phone and I rang my mum and she had like you know them like little old school Nokia phones or mm -hmm, something. Mm -hmm. So I rang my mum. My mum's like, "What are you doing?" I was like, "Mum, she's pissed. She's drunk. Like she's pissed. She's in a corner." Um, I'm talking to you. And I was like, "Mum," she was like, "Look, just good luck, whatever." I couldn't leave it there. I had to ring her again. So I'm taking mm. a big risk here, mm. but I had to speak to my mum. Anyway, so I've done that, and then we go back to London, and this is it. You're going to stay, you stay in a hotel one night and they check your big brother suitcase because mm. you're not allowed, no, what's the word? Contraband. Contraband. Mm. Not like, but back then, baby, you weren't allowed eyeliner, lip liner because you could have used it to write things out. Mm. Peak times. You want your makeup you know I mean? and you're like, yeah. I mean, back then we never had eyebrows anyway. Yeah. But we need to. You can always tell when the picture was taken by the eyebrows, <laughs> innit? Yeah, 100%. <laughs> so mm. it's the day of me going in. And um, I've been kept in hiding to the point, I'll say, and anyone that's been a big brother back in the day knows, they even cover your face to the point that I used to get, I used to feel sick sometimes, that like when they're moving you from one bit to another, yeah, yeah. that's how much they don't want you to be seen, yeah? yeah? So it's the night of me going in. And what I've done, going back to my friend Tiffany, how did you tell her? I'd written all my like my tight people a letter. a letter. So I'd written them all a letter and I knew when I stepped out that car and you go on, is it a runway stage? I don't know what it's called. I knew that feeling, you know, most people might take in a crowd. I was thinking all my people were going to be at my mum's mm. reading my letters. Hello. Yeah. Like, mm. I was so excited. And um, like, I was so happy. Did you tell your mum? 
My mum, oh yeah, of course. Yeah. My mum, yeah, yeah, yeah. My mum and dad knew 100%, but they were the only people. And my boyfriend, but that's a, yeah. My mm. boyfriend knew. Trust um, me, trust me, dude. He done well, though. He done well. He yeah, done well. Up. Oh, they hotted you up. Yeah, would you? My girl, oh, going the, my girl going in the big brother. I saw the hot that up so quick. <laughs> Spray. Yeah, you're not in no house. Immediately, you're gone. <laughs>